All right, we're doing it again. Another movie. Day two of breaking in my boots. I'm going to do a top to bottom run at Snowmass. I'm here at Snowmass. Today I put my old liners in my new boot shells. It's a little easier. You don't feel so bionic going down the hill, a little looser. So you do that for a couple days and then you take your new liners, put them in your new boots, and then you, you slowly break them in. Uh, I was like, to have my boots broken in by January. So, anyways, top to bottom, I'm going to pick up my influencer stick. And this is going to be a 360 video so you can move it around on the screen and see where I'm at the whole way down. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go try to ollie onto a picnic table. Uh, from there, I'm going to go down to the park, catch uh, catch air, and then ride the little mini bank pipe. Got a booter right up the gates. Stress on this. I am riding the... Uh, 155 Academy Master Series, designed by Tahoe legend Chris Roach. Super fun snowboard. Early rise, nose and tail. Gonna give me that extra float and powder. Micro camber, just the right amount of camber to, to grip the snow, but not too much where it's gonna be very aggressive, like the graduate. I mean, graduate is more my snowboard, I guess. I really like riding half pipe. And, you know, it's the charger. This is more of the rad dad feel good free ride board. It's a directional board. Uh, the holds are set almost towards his back. Following this turn guy skier, just really laying in. He's actually doing some nice turns, but I'm gonna pass him. See? You do that in Summit County, you'll get clipped by a yellow coat. Anyways. Yeah, so this course is great. Good for high speed. That micro camera is the perfect amount of camber. Going fast and being in control. And there's a lot of chatter on the internet these days about big soft boards. And uh, I like average, average boards. And that's what this is. Super fun board. No taper. Best part about taper is, best part about not having taper is this. Your board is going to track correctly when you're going backwards. Good for half pipe, good for half cabs. I got you see that? Like two inches off the ground right there. Anyways, I really like this. Uh, Trying to is good for goofy footers. You are toe side all the way down. It's a little off. Fall line around. It's called sneaky. Not really that sneaky, but it's got good views of Garrett and uh, Garrett and the Peak. And you can see from the top. Right, I'm gonna go hit these moguls. These are moderate moguls. I'm all about those moderate moguls. And I said it's the only place you can find kickers going into the moguls. Now they have parks everywhere. Sick kicker over there at backflip. I'm the back is in the powder. Alright. People are really getting aggressive on this run. I think I'm just gonna do one run and uh, go hike the mini pipe. It is a Sunday. A Sunday in Breckenridge. Is, uh, is not like this. This is actually very, very mellow. The reason there's a few people here is because this is where the fronts converge. This board also has carbon right in front of the mining and behind the mining for extra leverage when you're buttering and just to give you a little extra support on the nose and tail. Info, you know what I'm saying? Snowman. This is a great, great place to ride. I posted a video yesterday of, uh, I got the behind the scenes 
story from Todd Richards, but it was an MTV event in 1994 here at Snowmass. Oh, this guy's getting loose. It's in the backpack. Uh, I, I'm gonna hit this picture table, then I'll finish my story. Didn't crash today. But anyway, I still got the mic on. Yeah, Todd Richards said it was an MTV event in Snowmass in 94. I really got to fix my mic, sorry guys. This is how you become a professional influencer. You gotta have good mics. All right, this should be good. I should be on now. Let me make sure I'm still recording. Oh yeah. All right, we got a kicker here. Don't want to miss those kickers. This is a quick one, built for skiers. Uh, so yeah, 1994, there was a half pipe event here through MTV. MTV put it on. Terrier showed up, Brushy, Dave Downing, Peter Line, Todd Richards. I didn't see any clips of Todd. But he, you know, sounds like he was there. Mike Bassage, Shannon Dunn, Jimmy Scott, Kennedy. I think that's where maybe Dave Lee met Kennedy, because I'm pretty sure they're married. Kennedy used to be a famous MTV host. Uh, yeah, it was, uh, if you have a chance, go Google Transworld Video Magazine number four. There's a Mac Dog production on YouTube and you'll find the video of some of the most classic Colorado half-pipe footage ever. And this was, uh, in Todd's opinion, uh, when he, he, when Terry was his favorite snowboarder, at least. There's a, a cat era, of a swordboard era, and I think right after is when he was like super on point doing these at heel side alley-oops, fake heel, heel side alley-oops, and, uh, Back to back with twists, regular to fake, you know, whatever, anything and every, everything. He was noticeably better than everybody. So, anyways, yeah, Snowmass has some really cool snowboard history. Even though when you come here now, it's mostly free skiers in the park doing Cossacks or whatever they do, I don't know. And mostly uphillers like this guy. How do people like to walk up the hill these days? I don't know. I call them Nick Fiddies. Came from Jeff Borgo. Apparently the term Nick Fiddy was coined by the Mountain Gazette in a story called Know Your Mountain Neighbor. So most mountain neighbors now are uh, remote workers, you know. It's really hard to get a job in the past few days and afford to truly live here. All right, here it is. I'm gonna extend that pole a little bit. I'm gonna get a shot. My buddy Dave's on the, the knuckle. Coaches on the knuckles bring chairs these days. I'm gonna get him in trouble, but. See, told you, no snowboarders. There's not one snowboarder here. Sorry, it's all good. Oh. Still, no more snowboarders. Big pack of skiers. We'll spot some sooner or later, but you know, they're very rare. Alright, 
down to the other part. It's a long run. Probably one of the longer groomers out there. Coca-Cola. Just gonna do 50-50s because I have brand new edges. I don't like dull edges. Get a back 50 pop. Nailed it. Getting out of breath. It's like an Austin Sweden Canadian pillow potato sack movie. So long that you can't really breathe at the end. Alright. Hope you enjoyed this tech talk. Top to bottom, Snowmass Mountain, 360 degrees, taking things to the next level, breaking in new boots. Like I said, put your old liners, old liners in your new shells if you want to break in boots more comfortably. Best part about it over here is the mellow lift lines. You're not going to spend the majority of your day in the lift line. You're going to spend it on the hill. <laughs>